hi guys and welcome back so if you're new to my channel hello hello I am it's Andrea Michelle sis so um I'm just coming into your life right now I'm gonna come into your life with some weight loss advice okay um so today I will not be doing a cook with me I will not be doing any cleaning videos um today um and I'm just like I said I'm bringing a little bit of weight loss journey my weight loss journey if you want to follow you can follow um, definitely hit that thumbs up and also um, turn on post notifications and hit all don't hit occasionally hit all notifications so that you can get um, my videos when they upload so enough of that ramble um, so I am starting my official weight loss journey today I am very excited I was going to take my son uh, with me but I'm a whole single mom out here of one and sometimes my mind especially when I work a lot of hours and my son has didn't tell me that oh mom my shoes don't fit anymore he's growing like a sprout and he's seven he's growing out his clothes he's growing out his shoes he's eating up the house um so he forgot to tell me and as a mom I should have known that you know, my son needs some shoes, but um, I got to get him a whole pair of shoes and um, he, then he'll go walking with me. He was really upset, a whole hot mess, throwing shoes, shoes that he can't even wear. He's throwing shoes across the floor. He's very upset because he wants to be with his mom. Um, so probably Thursday or Friday, off days, I'll go grab him. Get him some good walking shoes and good play shoes. Well, not good play shoes. I'll just go to a Walmart or Target's and get him play shoes. And then I'll just go to um, or order him some shoes offline. Um, hopefully, I can go to like maybe uh, Burlington by my house or Marshall's and get him some great shoes. Because my son has a wide feet. <laughs> so, sometimes it can be a little hard to come by. If you have a child, a son, a daughter that is growing like a sprout, let me know in the comment section below. Let me know. <sighs> Just let me know what y'all doing um, through this whole Corbett 19. I am very interested to know um, if you have any video suggestions for me because your girl's running out of, you know, videos. And I can clean all day, <laughs> but I know I want to, like, mix things up. And I'm going to wipe this camera. But I like to mix things up with my channel. So um, that's what I'm really looking for. But yeah, I'm going on a whole weight loss journey. I am 221 pounds. The biggest I've ever been. Um, my son is 7. I had postpartum depression really bad. I went to Rancid Eating. Long story short. Had baby father issues. And... Uh, here we are seven years later and I'm still holding on to this baby weight, the C-section weight, um, and not even really was giving a crap about my weight. And I don't want to be someone that can't run after a child or can't run, period. Um, I'm not a runner, but I would love to like at least run a little bit. Um, and then also I do suffer from type 2 diabetes. So that has a lot to do with uh, my weight gain too as well. But um, over the years, I have tried, I have tried, tried to lose the weight, tried to lose the mommy pouch. And uh, yeah, it didn't work. It, it wasn't, it wasn't successful. Like when my uncle passed away, I still struggle to this day because I just feel like, you know, he was like my pusher, you know, he was like our motivator. He was like, girl, you better get up and get something done. He was like, my whole family is military, you guys. I am ex-military and I know better. So seriously, I know better. Um, and and um, and being in a military family, you have to keep your shape up. You have to, I don't know, like my uncle since he's been gone, we all just like, you know, gang weight. <laughs> he was like our pusher, he was like our motivator. So um, now it's about time that I get my shit together. Sorry, you guys. Get my stuff together and get right, you guys. Um, also, I'm going to be showing you guys what I do to prepare 
to go on my walks and stuff because I'm starting like a whole walk journey, like walking journey. So, um, because I'm not going to be going to any gyms anytime soon. So walking is a very good option for me. Um, and then, um, yeah, so let me show you guys what I got. And then I'm going to show you a haul really quick. And then we're going to go walking. I don't know if my sister is going to go with me today, but it will be nice because I don't want to go by myself. But um, the neighborhood that my mom stays in is pretty cool, pretty decent, pretty nice. And I don't have to worry about people running up on me and stuff like that. Because they don't want this. <laughs> they don't want none. <laughs> okay, let me stop exhaling. And I will show you guys really quick. Um how I prepare and what I do so we are in the kitchen right now I had to just transfer some things over this package right here is gonna be a review but I can't tell you guys yet what it's gonna happen and what's in this package but this is going um, I've used this before and it changed my life in the past it actually had me dropping weight so that's why I got this um, I do use my phone for like body goals, motivation goals. Um, this one, this young lady right here, I forget her name, but um, she is my body goal. If I can't get close to her, then I'll do uh, her right here. <clears throat> but they are both motivation goals uh, for my body and what I want to look like. Um, and then um, I have water here. I've been drinking water like crazy. Today I had like two of these. So that will be six cups of water. I only can handle three cups because of the, my doctor said that over watering yourself will make you sick. So I'm definitely going to just have another one of these after I finish this water. And I normally put like lemons in it to make it taste really good and fresh. And you can also add mint leaves, fruits, whatever you want. But on an ideal walk, I will fill this up with ice and water and take it with me. I will try to have some tight leggings or something with pockets on them so I can put my bottle of water in there. Um, also, I take my sanitizer because literally I will be touch touching steps when I am doing like my squats and I'm doing my stretches and stuff like that. Um, I'll take that just in case. Um, and then before I go, I try to Vaseline up my legs because I don't want to be out here all ashy. You know, I have to Vaseline my my arms and fingers and stuff like that um and then plus we have to wear the mask so i try to vaseline my face up so it won't get like chapped or get any like you know bumps or anything on there then i have been taking these nature wise cla 1250 exercise um enhanced exercise um pills here these are really good i love it because i'm almost out and they said that i can get a free bottle on them my next purchase so i'm really excited about that then also i got the thermal boost nature wise it's like my favorite because it's vegan um vegan friendly it's soy free gluten free and non-gmo so i love this and this boosts your metabolism to burn more calories um and i just love using these two together then i use my citrum um one a day women's tablet i love this as well i've been taking them for a while um and this really helps with like my hair growth my nail growth and um just in all general it helps with probiotic as well too also i do have a dd's haul coming up in just a second but i do stretch um before i go and leave but i mainly exercise a lot when i'm like uh by the stairs at the park when i go walking so hope you guys enjoy so my next thing that i'm going to show you is the dd's discount i really got to charge this camera because it is like blinking like honey you need to charge me i'm about to go dead you need to feed me <laughs> so and then after my walk i'll definitely show you guys like um what I eat and stuff like that. Um, I just decided to just do this by myself this time with no help. I'm not telling anybody because people are so negative when you tell them, oh, I'm about to lose weight. They don't want you to look cuter than them. They don't want you to be happy. So this time, I'm you guys, really quick, my camera died. She was like not having it. So what I was saying is this time, I'm just thinking all positive i'm keeping god ahead of everything i'm praying and i'm praising him as I, i'm on my journey my weight loss journey and um i'm just i'm just gonna have fun doing this i'm gonna motivate myself you guys are gonna keep motivating me i know this 
because Andrea Michelle sis is on her way. Um, so like I said, I'm 220, 21, 22 pounds. You guys, I'm going to start weighing myself in on Mondays and weighing myself out on Fridays to see where I'm at. And then, um, yeah, you guys, my main focus is my tummy area, the C-section area. Hi, Ashton. <laughs> and my... Remember to give us a thumbs up and don't give us a thumbs down. No, please don't. <laughs> um, and yeah, I'm my my current weight, like I say, is two twenty one to twenty two pounds, and I am wanting to be at least what I used to be, which was one hundred and sixty pounds. But every time I lose five pounds, that's when I add five pounds. I'm not gonna be like I'm gonna lose this such and such this much, and. You know, I don't do it. So my goal is to tell myself five pounds this time, five pounds next time, five pounds, five pounds. And then once I lose those five pounds all the way to I get to 160, then that's when I stop. I'm not going to be losing any more weight, um, but I'm going to definitely be um, keeping myself up um, as a mama. We as mamas, we always like our kids our our spouses, our boyfriends, girlfriends, whatever we um we, we, we put them first, and it's true, we put them first, but now it's time to put ourselves first, and um, it's just time for us to put ourselves first, and just tell them, hey, y'all gonna, y'all have to be on the back burner just a little bit, just a, you know, a little bit, <laughs> um, so that we can keep ourselves, I would love to get my nails done, I would love to get my feet done, you guys, I would love, like, I got my hair done, and did I feel bad about it? I'm not going to lie, y'all. I didn't feel bad about it. The whole $180 worth of um, uh, box braids, I was not, I was not like, shame, y'all. I'm a whole mom out here. I haven't done anything for myself, and this is what I want, and this is what I want to accomplish. I know my son, my son's going to have my back 100% at seven years old, okay? He wants to go out and walk with me, and I just feel so bad that, his mommy didn't even know he had in his feet had grown out his shoes that quick. Okay, but yes, let's get into this Didi's haul. I'm gonna go ahead and take all this stuff out so it can be a quick little haul, you guys. So this video is gonna be a little bit all over the place, but I wanted to just show you what I have on when I go work out. Just something comfortable, really comfortable, nothing cute because it's never for anybody, any man, nothing like that. So um, I just do this because I love to. When you wear something. Um, loose or you know when you wear something loose fitted I just feel like you know I don't know I just don't like I want to wear something loose fit but me personally I just like to wear my tights um, so I have uh, this born and raised shirt which is you know in Texas I was born and raised in Texas y'all so. and um, I have this shirt on and then these green like tight fitted um these green tight fitted shorts here. Now I'm gonna tell you really, really quick. Um, I do carry like a pen or something with me. My mom always taught me don't be walking anywhere without something you can cut somebody up with or you can make somebody with. We don't play around here in Texas, so um, don't walk up on me and expect to leave uh, unharmed if you're trying to harm me. So <laughs> uh, yeah, I just keep something, I keep my keys. And I have my ID with me, just in case. Um, but yeah, I got these these tights on, and then I just have some Walmart <laughs> Walmart shoes, cause that that's what I can afford um, for myself. So this Diddy's haul is gonna be basically uh, for me because I want to do something for myself um, because I'm always doing stuff for my son and my family so this is for me um i didn't know Didi's carried old navy active so i got an extra large just for room and i love that it has this tight fitted a uh, waistband here on the on there um these are black and then also they have like this mesh mush mesh <laughs> um like mesh where you can see through and actually get a little air as well and then it also has it there um, and it just kind of wraps around. If I ever wear these, I'll definitely show you guys. These are only seven bucks at DD's. And these are old navy. These will cost you what 15, 18, 20. I don't know. Um, but when I saw old navy, I was like, I gotta get up on that. So I found some more for like $7.99. 
and these are our media pocket and um, it normally has like what how much it would be like actual price um, but I got these because they are pink they're really cute um, and they have pockets I try to get things with pockets on the side so I can carry my stuff um, and then they have like the little polka dot holes through them where the air can breathe through um, and these are extra large as well and those are really cute I love those and then I got this Kathy uh, Kathy curvy and this top was only $5.99 and also this has mesh in it too because I definitely want to feel comfortable when I'm walking so um, I got this and it's kind of like a body trimmer like a waster so on the side has like these little things right here to keep your stomach in also got something much needed was a potato pillar I know this is like something that ain't got nothing to do with uh, working out but I just wanted to share with you guys look at look at this young man back here <laughs> and um, you said that like a thousand times remember to subscribe remember to thumbs up you guys that's my son he's AJ and he 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 wants us to grow he wants our family to grow okay because you guys know I don't see you as subscribers I see you all as my family individually and we all we all got some in common um, especially our single moms out there even our moms with you know the support we all got some in common and you guys are my family sis so yeah I got the fiberware uh, potato thing also he said if y'all have any comments comment below um, and so much needed mama's yes yes the feet get real sometimes when I forget about you know my whole pedicures uh, the feet gets real so I got this um, pedicure this petty foot foul haven't used this before so yeah I got one of those and the last two are I got some Neutrogena Oil Balancing uh, Daily Exfoliator um, for my face, and I've used this for two days, and my face has been clearing up. I've been I was getting bumps in certain spots. You guys, mamas know that time of the month. So yeah, I, I got this right here, and it just like took the bumps away. I got that also at Didi's for $4.99. Uh, the foot foul was hold on, go in the bathroom and wash that. The foot foul was $3.99. Diddy's is so cheap, you guys. I love this store. And the potato pillow was $2.99. And I bought some fragrances, uh, Clorox fragrance. Um, this one is a uh, the Island Orchard. And this one is Morning Sky. Morning Sky to me, it's my favorite. It smells so good. This will also go into my bathroom. And this will go into my living room. I'm going to hide it like under a table or something. Or under my couch. Um, because it gives it like, you know, it smells so good. <laughs> um, but these were, how much were they? $1.99 and $1.99. They both were $1.99. But yeah, I bought... All that I bought that stuff, and then I bought Ashton a couple of things, uh, toys and some books and stuff like that. So my whole total was like 60, 60 some dollars. I don't remember the rest, but I know it was six some dollars and some change. And I didn't know it was on tax free, um, tax free days. So I hit the jackpot. It was just like sixty three dollars and whatever change and no tax. <laughs> so. Or it might not even been changed. It might have just been $63. Um, so, yeah. But anyways, you guys, let me get prepared for my walk and my journey. Can't wait for you guys to come along with me and just watch me while I work. Um, I'll try to have it to where you guys can also do it, too. Once, um, what, I'll figure it all out because I want you guys to... Um, Go on this journey with me and um i'm gonna be doing trying to do two miles and i think two miles will be like 45 40 or 45 minutes um so yeah i'm gonna try to hit that today i do have my fitbit i cannot find my new fitbit for anything i don't know what is going on like some of my stuff is just like coming up missing but in general general i'm a mother and i probably misplaced it um so yeah i probably misplaced it somewhere in my house but right now I'm at mom's and today I did 10,000, I don't know if you guys see it, 10,033 10, steps basically and my heart rate is 100 right now and uh, I burnt, what is this, 
I burnt a hundred um, fat burnt. It was a hundred percent. So yeah, I am gonna love my other Fitbit, like the one that looks like kind of like an eye, eye watch, because this tells you like your calories and all that stuff. But this one is just I don't know. It's my bag up. So it it actually tells you like what's really going on with you, but it doesn't tell you calories. So yeah. But anyways, if you guys want to follow me on um, um, Fitbit, I'll have the link and stuff in the description. If you want to follow me on Instagram because I'm going to be more active over there, you can do that. I do have my website. I just got to get it all together. Get it together. Change some things. Move some things. Make things happen. Add my workouts and stuff in and my links to my video there. Um, but if you want to see what I got happening in my, um, website right now, just go to my Instagram page, which will be linked below and check it out. Um, and it's free. It's free. Okay. The website that I found is called Milkshake and it's totally free. Like I couldn't believe I found it. And I had so many, so much traffic going on over there. It's just crazy, you guys. I'm also going to be putting up a Poshmark app. I'm going to be selling some things on there, so I'm excited about that. You guys, I'm just trying to grow, 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 grow. Um, I'm tired of the struggle. And I mean, it's not real, real, but you know, I'm just tired of the whole 9 to 5 and, you know, all that good stuff. But, um... Your reds are eye. Your reds, your eyes are also red. Y'all, my eyes are red. Hold up, wait a minute. You, Why they red? Why they red? Why they red? Maybe touch them, maybe sleepy. No, I'm my little sleepy because I got up early this morning to go to work, but I still gotta push, baby. Gotta keep pushing for you, okay? I love you. And I love you. I love you too. Aw. So I'm out here walking and it is this. I mean, the sun is beaming, you guys, but I'm not going to let that be the reason why I don't walk three times, four times, five times um, where I'm at. I would love to show you guys where I'm work, walking at, but right now I can't. <laughs> I'm not going to do that because it's going to show too much of where I stay and um, just not trying to have that right now. Um, but anyways, I may do my workout. Can you guys get in to see me? I may do my work my workout once I get back to the house because it is really hot out. My mom, I'm at my mom's house today, and she cooks and stuff. So um, once I get done with this, I'll go back to her house. But I'm not gonna eat what they're gonna eat because I don't want that. I can't get off track. Um, so I'm just gonna walk around like maybe four or five times and um, then go back. Did water up and everything and um but yeah it's the highlight of the day you guys it's hot out and she's like you're gonna fall out blah, blah, blah. I said I can't let that be the reason I why I don't work out um, and there's a lot of people that walk in the daytime I do it because my hours on my job and this is the only time I get a chance to walk, you guys. This is the only time. So hot or not, rain or shine, snow or windy, your girl's got to get this way down. So, yeah. But anyways, let me get this walk in. Just walking. As you can see getting it in okay I'm on my first lap where I'm walking and this is a long lap I kind of started on the side where there's no where there's no sun and there's a lot of shade um, and yeah there's a lot of sun on the other side but enough shade on this side so yeah, I just encourage you guys to get up, get motivated. Um, like I say, there'll be people that's negative, very negative. I just experienced it and I stay positive. And um, I'm out here, I didn't listen. And uh, yeah, 
And the reason why I'm beating hard is because I haven't worked out in a long time, so that's gonna be normal. Um, like I said, I watered up, I prayed, I'm gonna be praying on my journey. And yeah, you guys, uh, let me go ahead. Once I get to like my second or third walk, I definitely will come back to you guys. But I'm gonna be listening to on my workout playlist. If you guys didn't know, I have a like a whole like whole um, cleaning playlist full of everything, you guys, <laughs> from country to R and B to rap. Um, and I do have a Christian playlist. And um, yeah, I yes. <laughs> So I'm going to be listening to my cleaning playlist as I walk. And so you guys see the sun is beaming on my face. Um, so yeah, let me get this in, you guys. Um, may not be a two-mile walk today, but it's definitely going to be something, okay? So yeah, let me go ahead and walk, and I'll get back to you guys in just a second. Um, so I'm still on walk. Well, I'm on walk too right now. Um... But I wanted to tell you guys this really quick. Once you start doubting, can I do this? Am I able to get through this? Can I push through this without anyone helping me? I'm motivated, you guys. I'm by myself and I'm motivated. How long am I gonna be motivated? You know, I'm gonna, like I said, keep God first, a step ahead of you, and uh, pray about it as you walk. And He's gonna always, I don't know if you guys see me, He's gonna always. Um, he's always he's gonna always um, have your back on things um, so yeah um, but if you start to doubt yourself then you're gonna you're gonna pretty much stop um, what you're doing and you're gonna get disencouraged and you're not gonna be um, able to stay motivated and everything that you're working hard for is gonna come to a crashing end so um just continue to pray um, and take this journey whether with someone or without someone and um, yeah you can do it um, if you put your back into it <laughs> I'll just like, um, yeah but let me get on that third walk I realized that that heat was heat for real you guys see every time I would walk on this a certain side it was just so freaking hot and I couldn't bear it it was beating against my thighs like my thighs really bad and my legs and then the side of my face here and um, yeah um, it was I'm filming off my phone so if you hear any clicks clacks whatever it might be messages might be someone calling 
but um, yeah, it was just beating me up. The sun was beating me up. So I'm going to have to find a way to, at least I did, I was motivated. I walked around three times. I didn't hit that fourth or fifth, um, well, the two mile goal, but I did walk around three times. And boy, I'm going to tell you, like, this sun out here in Texas ain't playing, like, seriously. Um, but yeah, today, that is the end, you guys. I do want to say that keep your phone with you, keep your recorder on, because you got to protect yourself, your front, and your back. So I use my phone for just to kind of look behind me, because who has time to look back? And then if somebody comes in, in front of you, um, they can get you like that. So um, make sure you have your phone, your recorder on. I would say like record every five minutes if you have to, if you hear anything um, behind you, just in case, you know, if somebody grabbed me up, at least I have it on my phone. I'm trying to turn it towards the person that is trying to attack you so you can get some footage and then throw your phone somewhere where people can find it. Um, just if anything happened, but you guys, I was prayed up walking. I covered myself in the blood of Jesus and I kept walking. So it wasn't the goal that I wanted to hit, but I still was motivated. I still was positive, and I kept walking, and I kept thinking good things while I was on my walk. Um, so, yeah. But anyways, you guys, can't wait for the next weight loss video and some cleaning videos as well. Cleaning burns calories, you guys. So, yeah, I'm going to do a clean with me video, and then I'm going to do a cooking video, and then I'm going to do weight loss. That's how we're going to do it. Cleaning, cooking, weight loss. So I'll see you guys later. Thanks for joining me on my whole weight loss journey.